am Mr. Thompson. I am Mr. Simpson. Yes, this is Mr. Ejum. Hi, my name is My name is Jaden. This is. And my name is Julio. And we're trying all types of Dominican candy. We're gonna try merengue first. Merengue. Merengue. So it kind of melts as like you you chew down on it. So this is kind of like. I'm gonna go with something that somebody else, I heard somebody else say. It's kind of like a dried up marshmallow, right? So I have a sweet tooth, so this is this is sweet, but it's not too sweet for me. Um, I like it a lot. I think that the texture though is a little crumbly, so you gotta be careful when you eat it or it'll just get everywhere. I think it tastes like milk. I like the texture. Um, it kind of tastes like milk. Like it's really good, like it has a really, Good texture to it. You can, even though it dissolves, dissolves in your mouth, you can still like taste it. Like very good. Probably wouldn't give it to my kids. It feels a, a high amount of sugar in it, so it may be, it may kind of set them off a little bit. <laughs> So this is like blatantly, very like heavy coconut flavor, chewy, sweet. Um, I like that chewiness aspect to it because that's, that's part of like, I think a lot of stuff that you get with coconut. So I, I'm glad that's there. So I really like the coconut macaron a lot. And so they sell this at PR, but I would say that they're like a little bit different. They still taste like cocoa, but they have like a slight bit of like vanilla taste like they taste more kind of like vanilla than cocoa but they still good like this this is good not too sweet kind of like middle middle sweetness um very good end of the meal dessert in my opinion wait you got a freaking yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 that's hey. all mine we're gonna have to fight for this one no 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 Take just a little piece. Give me the banana. No. Oh. no. Mm. Mm. The best one. Okay, so this came out from what looked like a little peanut butter jar. It's called Dulce de Leche. Um, yeah, let's give it a shot. It is pretty good. It's almost like a, uh, like a Werther's original. It's weird, right? It tastes it like, tastes like yeah. yeah. It, it tastes is. sweet. Just it's un poquito. Yeah. A little, a lot, a lot sweet. Not for me. For me, it is. Your taste buds are, <laughs> I mean, your taste buds are messed up. Um, I feel like it needs a little, little more, like, more flavor, but I still like it. It's like a, like a pudding a little bit. Um, not too sweet, not too sweet. Tastes pretty good, but very good with the uh, coconut, coconut when you, when you um, dip it in. Oh, yeah, I like this a lot. I don't know how you would eat it though, because like, you're just going to be spooning into the thing, like, that just looks like broken dreams. You're just like crying over like a breakup or something, eating dolce de leche. Why did they leave me? Like I, I don't, I don't, I don't know how to consume this in a way that's not like just obviously things have gone wrong with your life. It's like burnt burnt waffle. They don't really like. For me, I feel like it don't really taste like strawberry as much as it smells. It, like I said, it smells like burnt on waffle. Well, it's not burnt. Do it, it's really good. It smells. No, no, don't say bad things about my favorite thing. Smell it! It smells burnt, it smells like a house that was on fire. No, no, no. Get her! Mm-mm, no, her. It smells like a uh, uh, strawberry. You need to get your It is strawberry, right? But it also has like a little pinch of like sour. 
like this kind of like it has kind of like a sour taste i like this one but not as much as the macaroon just because this is a lot denser and it's mixed in with something else that's sweet that i like but i feel like you almost have to eat it with something else to like lessen how sweet it is not bad very sweet Ooh. Back to the kitchen. So I think my favorite one's probably gonna be the coconut macarons. The reason is it's just that like I like coconut, I like macaroons, I don't really need like an additional thing to eat with it to really like bring it to its highest level. So to me my favorite one is probably the coconut macarons. Uh, in addition, there are no macarons. My favorite would probably be the uh, strawberry wafers. It's a more subtle flavor. All the other ones are like, uh, but um, there are some really good candies and um, and sweets and pastries. But I like the wafers. The coco, besitos de coco. It had to be besitos de coco. I'm sorry. I love my merengue, but besitos de coco. They have to be. My favorite was besitos or coconetes. Um, because apparently I'm not allowed to say that these are blatantly coconut macaroons. So the coconetes and the besitos were probably my favorite just because I think they're the strongest like as a standalone where I don't need to do anything additional for me to feel like it's at its best. Uh, so overall, this was really great because despite my Puerto Rican students telling me that Dominican candy is nasty, it was all pretty good. So like the continued culture war between Puerto Ricans and Dominicans is free to go on because Dominicans, yeah. Alright, eat your mouth.